Hi there. Uh, recently, the hinge that was on this kitchen cupboard door broke. Oops. Uh, it broke, and now the problem was, this was the one that uh, broke, and the problem was I couldn't find anything that was anyway, anywhere sort of similar to that uh, hinge that was going to work on this door. I could only find these sort of big ones. And you can see there, if you look at the, uh, where that's where it attaches into the cupboard, you've got totally different uh, screw holes there. We've got, the new one's got one on each side, and then the old one had this one where you had a big screw in the middle. Now, my problem was that once I, um, well, when I was going to attach that new hinge to the cupboard, I've got old screw holes um, in the cupboard that's looking a bit unsightly, and also that the depth of the hinge is a little bit different. The old one was a bit higher, I think, than, than the new one. Okay, so what I did was, <coughs> I found a bit of this old plastic, I think some sort of a channel cover that I had floating around in the garage, and I've cut little sections out of that, and I've put it on um, and I'll show you what I've done. So you can see there that I've I've uh, cut that little bit of plastic into a section, nice neat little section. Put it over the um, put it over the, the the cupboard where all your holes are, your old holes are for the hinges, and then screwed your new hinge down through that plate um, into the uh, the cupboard. So that uh, makes it sort of a neat finish, and that also actually pushes the, the hinge this way a little bit. Um, and that's what I needed as well, was the hinge to be pushed this way for everything to, to fit neatly. Um, obviously, if you, if you didn't need the hinge to push neatly, you might be able to just find a, little, a flat little piece of plastic like that to cut into shape. And nice and white, same colour, and it fits over neatly. And there's the bottom one uh, down there. And the bottom one I've done the same thing with. Okay, there we go, the cupboard door's uh, back on, and it's going pretty good, and there's the uh, hinges attached back on the cupboard door. All looking pretty neat, and no sign, no sign of any of the old holes, screws for the holes from the old hinges.